Hey everybody. You know, I just did this broadcast and it didn't save to my camera roll, so I couldn't upload it to YouTube. <laughs> so I'm going to do it again. Look at that hurt. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm going to show you some things that I pulled that I really liked. You might hate them all, but uh, trust me, there's plenty of things here that you're going to like that uh, maybe weren't my favorite things. Um, right now, my three racks are stuffed full. I ordered a fourth one so I could space things out to make shopping easier for everybody uh, next Sunday when they come to the open house. Um, it, I'm really excited about it. I think it's going to be so cool. Um, if you can't make it to the open house, please uh, make time to come to the uh, stop into the Periscope shopping experience um, on Monday night between 7 and I'm going to try to hold it to a maximum of 3 hours because uh, like at 10 o'clock I turn into a pumpkin, meaning I go to sleep. I'm really going to be tired um, at that point because I am still working full time. Um, and in any case, I want to be able to get your invoices out to you. Um, hopefully the next day and then um, you know be able to ship everything out so you have them you know toward the end of the week so hopefully that'll all work this is all new for me so I'll get better at it as time goes on and I know you guys are are cheering me on so I'm really happy about that it's an exciting new thing in any case I know you're here to see the clothes so I'm gonna start um, really cool patterns, really neat stuff. Um, I'm going to start with some of the Nicole's that I got in. Um, I thought this was really pretty because it could be accessorized with just about any color. Red, yellow, even that like aqua or teal type except chunky accessories. Just thought this was so, so pretty. Really liked how it just looks like paintbrush strokes. Thought this was so neat. Um, in the Nicole's, something that came in that I hadn't seen yet, um, but I got lots of them in the different sizes and lots of different colors, t-shirt dresses. Um, still that same, same style, twirly skirt, uh, same nice little detail on the arms, Lo you know, the longer sleeve, really like it, but it's that really nice t-shirt material that's going to be lightweight, really casual, you can wear it anywhere. You can really dress it up or down, um, but for me, it would be a really nice casual piece. Um, I love this indigo color. I think it's beautiful. Um, in person, it looks a little more purple than blue, but I can see on the camera, it's looking really blue. Loved this one. It's that heather, um, almost like a red with the purple. <laughs> love it, wish it was in my size. But there were lighter colors too. There were pinks, there were peaches, there were even grays. Um, so there were there were some really great t-shirt ones. This one is gonna be so polarizing. <laughs> people are gonna love it or hate it. Probably more people will hate it than love it, but somebody out there is gonna love this dress. Um, on the camera, you probably can't tell if it's black or navy blue. It is navy blue and it's a bird print. And I know someone is gonna absolutely love this. And I just think it's really neat. And it's that uh, same fabric that if you're familiar with the Cassie's, uh, the, the Cassie pencil skirt, it's that same stretchy, soft fabric. And, I, you know, it's growing on me. I didn't like it when I first saw it. I like it now. Okay, this one I really like. It's like a stained glass print. Uh, it came in two colors in my inventory. And this one was my favorite of the two. I don't know why, it just really appealed to me. I thought it was very pretty. This also came in a couple colors. This came in the red base and then this blue base. And I thought it was very Native American looking. I thought it was very, very pretty. Very neat. Now for you that, you know, you're scared of all these 
prints. You're like too much color, too many prints. And you like your solids, but you like them with a little interest maybe. Here's a navy blue dress. And look at that beautiful detail. I hope you can see it. It's coming through really well when I'm looking at it. It has almost a geometric weave into the fabric and I think it looks really nice. Okay, I'm going to show you some Lindsay's. Lindsay is a nice layering piece. If you work in an office like I do or like I am, I'm perpetually cold. Um, Lindsay's great because it's just a nice little piece to keep you warm. It also is a good bathing suit cover up out on the beach. This one is so pretty. My husband is at the door there looking at me, watching me. Hi, honey. <laughs> anyway, this one I loved because it was pink and you can't see it. I can't get the light to pick up the silver thread, but it is on there. Now, Lindsay, I can wear any size in a Lindsay, a small, medium, or a large. It just kind of depends on how big and flowy I want it to be. If I wear the large, the sleeves come down here. If I wear the small, they're more up here, the three-quarter length. So if you see a Lindsay you like, just try it on. Decide whether you like the fit. This one is more of a t-shirty material. It's not, it's not really t-shirt. It's just more of a closed weave. You can see, and I like this geometric. Now this one I think is going to get snapped right up. People love black, but also it's lightweight. can really double nicely as a bathing suit cover-up. Okay, my favorite thing that I'm carrying right now is Lola. Lola's a midi skirt. has a, an elastic waist and goes down below the knee. I love this green lace. It's, this is the only size that this came in in, I believe. This is an extra large, and I just adore it. This is a very soft, not scratchy lace. All of the Lolas have, oops, what's under there? Oh my goodness, somebody left some thread under there. It doesn't look like it's Lola's thread. Anyway, um, there's an underlayment under all of the Lola's. Sometimes it's a matching underlayment. Sometimes it's a little, it's contrasting. I'll show you what I mean with one of the chiffon Lola's in a bit. But all of them have this black waistband. And it is a pretty comfortable waistband. I find it comfortable. It's very stretchy. Here's the one I want to show you that contrasting underlayment. Look at that beautiful chiffon fabric with that floral. I think that is gorgeous. Here's the here's the colored underlayment. I think that's so pretty, that beautiful pink. Just gives a little <laughs> pop of color. Maybe nobody else sees it, but you know it's there and it kind of feels special. This one, I know it looks black on camera. You can't really tell, but this is a navy blue with this pink. It's very pretty. Love the geometric, almost Aztec pattern, but unlike Aztec prints, which are usually kind of on a, on a um, solid background, and not quite so repetitive. This looks like this. There you go. I got quite a few of the solid chiffons. They look like this. There you can see really well how the underlayment stops about four or five inches be below the overskirt. Um, lavender was one of the colors. I think I got peach. 
I got um, one of the sizes I got a bunch of the um, almost like a nude taupe color and that kind of happens with your initial inventory um, when they pick them uh, you tend to get a lot of multiples of fabrics um, so it, it to me it's kind of a bonus because when people come they you know there's not a lot of upset over oh so and so got something and I really wanted that so to me it's good um, as time goes on there will be less of that now here is this beautiful coral my light is kind of giving it a little bit of a yellow sheen but um, it's a beautiful coral lace and this is really soft I don't even know where they get lace so soft but I love the rose pattern on it you're gonna see roses in a lot of things here roses roses lots of floral but roses especially okay Irma Again, roses. Remember Irma? High, high, low in the back. I showed Irma the other day on my Facebook group. This is so incredibly soft. Color blocking is huge right now, and here's an Irma that's been color blocked for you. <laughs> I really like this. The, the sham, almost chambray pink or chambray blue with the pink sleeves and the pink collar. Love this pattern. I think this would look great with a pair of jeans. Love that. I pulled this not only because I thought it was a neat pattern with the butterflies. You can kind of see them a little better there but because it is the same softness as our leggings and we love our leggings <laughs> we love our leggings and if you're looking for something more sporty more casual there you go heather gray beautiful pink and blue stripe thought that was really cool. So I mentioned the leggings and if you saw I did mention on the Facebook group that they have been back ordered and so I wanted to mention that here a little bit. Um, yes they're back ordered. Um, one size leggings and tall and curvy leggings which are all the adult leggings um, are back ordered. I've been going on line every single day and trying to order some so far haven't been successful however um, as we enter summer I'm not too worried about that because if you're anything like me um, as the day starts you think eh, I could put on a pair of leggings I could put on a pair of long pants <laughs> but as the day goes on it gets a little bit warmer and you're too warm in those so I put on my leggings this morning and I ended up changing into shorts. So I'm not that worried. We're going into warmer weather now and I think leggings aren't gonna be as big of a deal and our warehouse is gonna catch up with the, the demand. So by, by the time we are looking at needing leggings again, it's not gonna be a problem. So um, I'm just not worried about it. You guys are gonna just love the styles that we have for you. <laughs> So it is not going to be an issue. Um, perfect tees. That's what I'm wearing right now. And I'm thick in the middle. I'm not going to lie. I know you can tell. Um, this flares away from the body. And I got a badunk -dunk. Um, I like the perfect tee. 
has slits on the side. You can wear it down with the slits open, or you can tie them like this. It gives it a little bit different of a shape. You can tie it on both sides, you can tie it on one side, it just gives it a little bit different of shape. And these with the with these stripes on the arms, really popular right now. This is also a perfect tee with these giraffes. If these were on leggings, we wouldn't be able to keep the leggings from people's hands because I don't know why people love those leggings with the animals. <laughs> Just love the giraffes though. Okay, Cassie's. This is the last thing I have to show you. And Cassie always comes in just the coolest prints. So I'm going to show you a few of these and you get to see just some of the neatest prints here. This one I just love. It's got like a teal background, gold, orange. Gorgeous. You cannot go wrong with black, gray, white, and red. This is a 3X. You ladies who are bigger, LuLaRoe aims to be able to fit sizes extra, extra small to 3X. They are, as I heard one consultant put it, a plus size girl's dream and they really are because their clothes are comfortable and they really do aim to fit as many women as possible comfortably and if you can wear a pencil skirt and be comfortable and wear anywhere from an extra large to a 3x and be comfortable in that skirt I, I think that they've performed some kind of magic voodoo because I know I am comfortable in their skirts. <laughs> this skirt I absolutely adore. Look at these roses. Again, with the roses. See that color right there? That subtle play off of, it's like a, almost like a magenta. I don't even know what you want to call that color. That's like a brown or a deep maroon. You would never think of putting those two colors together, but it's, it's an echo of this. And they just go perfectly. The art department churns out about 400 fabric designs a day. They don't all get chosen to be used, but they're constantly designing new fabrics to be used on our on our clothing. So I thought that was pretty cool when I heard that. Again, floral roses is the is the background. Here's my favorite Cassie that came in. Not my size, unfortunately. Medallion print bluish gray background. I think that's beautiful. This one, I've seen this print one time before on an Irma that I own. I have never, ever, ever seen it on anything else and that's very unusual. Usually I see it in a picture somewhere at least. Um, I had never seen the fabric anywhere else not on any other piece of LuLaRoe clothing. And then this arrived, so I do know that they used it somewhere else. In any case, um, I think this is an absolutely beautiful fabric. That Irma is probably my favorite piece of LuLaRoe clothing because I just love this fabric. And then finally, my last thing that I'm going to show you is just this really cool extra small Cassie with this just really awesome stripe. I just love how they 
used the the multi-tonal colors but then set them off with this yellow stripe this just thin yellow stripe I thought that was so pretty so that's what I have to show you um, I hope everybody's following me uh, in my Facebook group I hope that's how you got here um, and I hope that uh, you'll be following me on Periscope soon. I'm going to do a little tutorial um, about Periscope because I know it's new to a lot of people. I'm not a big fan of Facebook Live because it's not interactive. And um, if you have questions, please don't hesitate to post them on the Facebook group. I am more than happy to answer them. And please enter the contest to win the gift certificate. I am giving out a 25, a 10, and a 5. It can be used at my open house or it can be used um, at the online sale. And I'm really excited to give it to you. I want to give you free credit to use. Okay? So I will see you guys either at my open house next weekend or hopefully at the Periscope sale. Take care. Love you all. Bye.